Hello, this is Dr. Marcelo Cugumas. On behalf of the Chronic Liver Disease Foundation, I'd like to thank Madrigal Pharmaceuticals for their support in bringing you this educational content. Hello, I'm Reed Hogan, a practicing gastroenterologist in Jackson, Mississippi, part of a 40 provider group. Very busy with metabolic disease, liver clinic, fatty liver clinic. We screen probably 6,000 patients a year with fiber scans, so we know this sector well. Today we're talking about resmetrion or resdifra, trade name. A new, unique, novel medication that we've been waiting literally a couple of decades for. We've had nothing for fibrotic liver disease, nothing that blows the inflammation, and now we have a novel medication that works really well, gives us some answers. The mechanism of action of resdifra is decreasing triglycerides and hepatocytes to the thyroid stimulating hormone beta, axoni in the liver, which is remarkable. It has remarkable effects. It decreases triglycerides in the cells, improving the status of the cell and the decreasing the injury from fat cells or steatal hepatitis. The studies have shown improvement in fibrosis, improvement in inflammatory changes, amazing results, and finally we have something to treat these patients with. All of us have a huge number of these patients in our office, especially in gastroenterology. The liability of having these patients and not treating them is a really big deal to us. We have approximately 100 patients plus on therapy, probably written 150 prescriptions. Side effects are really rare. It tends to be diarrhea and nausea is the majority of the side effects. They are self-limited in our experience. We have one patient that we had to stop therapy because of ongoing diarrhea that we just could not control and would re-challenge it with her. So we've had one patient we had to stop medication. We've only had therapy now for about six to eight months, so we're just learning how to long-term, what to look for, when to do labs, but we're all getting that pretty well in a systematic manner, and patient's response so far has been very favorable. I think it's a medication that everyone involved in treating liver disease should be considering for their patients because there's really nothing else after exercise and diet. The not treating the patients is really not an option. And we think there'll be a lot of other indications, probably F1s, F4s. We don't know what the studies will show there, but all this is being studied heavily and the future looks bright for these patients. Bye. Thank you for listening. Allow me to give you a very brief update on Restifra. Thank you.